All right, let's answer a few questions. These are the questions that you might have in your head before you proceed with this course. First of all, will I need funding? You're going to be able to come up with lots and lots of great ideas after taking this course, but will you need funding to put them into action? Well, here's the thing. There are many, many ideas that you can start with a very, very minimal budget, just on a very tiny budget. And you're going to understand more about that as you proceed through the course. And certainly by the time you finish the course, you will understand this very, very well. And you will know how to come up with these very low budget, very, very low startup ideas. Next is, am I too old or am I too young? I do get this question from my students and I'm quite sure that there are many more students who think this but don't ask. Now, age really shouldn't be a barrier either way. Young people have an advantage in that they have more energy and in general, they can learn quicker. Older people have an advantage because they have that life experience. Now, there are people in their 50s, 60s, 70s, probably even 80s, who've come up with great ideas and started very successful ventures. Similarly, there are people in their early 20s, even in their teens, who've done the same. So age should never be a barrier. And what if my idea doesn't work? Well, as entrepreneurs, there are ways that we can validate and verify our ideas before we make a decision to proceed with it. And again, you will know how to do that once you've completed this course. What if I can't come up with any good ideas? Well, I feel confident that you will be able to come up with ideas and lots of them, as well as developing the ability to think outside of the box. There's going to be a lot of practical tuition in this course as well. So we're going to use various websites and resources to help you spot trends, spot opportunities and come up with ideas based on those trends and opportunities.